personal fit, welcome to Lunge Crunch. Today, core intervals, great way to work out. Uh, we've got several exercises from different angles that are really gonna challenge those muscles of the midsection, really just help keep your, your, your body supported and strong. Um, let me run through, and really all you need today, uh, if you have a mat or a towel for the floor that makes it a little more comfortable, this thing is so portable, you can do this workout anywhere. Uh, let me run through our exercises just real briefly so you get an idea of what's going on. Uh, we're going to start with the starfish. If you're not familiar with that, it's, it, you're kind of bringing opposite extremities toward each other. So you're kind of reaching across, and you kind of look like an, like an X, and you're kind of coming across opposite hand to foot. All right, you don't have to hit it, but that's kind of the direction you're going. Uh, then we're going to change body positions completely, and instead of that rotational movement, we're going to do a body saw where you're low plank, and we're going to go back and forth. Um, I think you'll like those, they feel pretty well. Uh, then we have a bicycle, so a cross crunch, toe reach. So we're gonna focus on one side at a time, then we'll hit the other side. Next exercise, uh, we'll give the lower body a break and we're gonna do Rockies. And these are a, a four count crunch that, that, that I kind of named uh, 20 years ago. But anyway, it's kind of a fun exercise. Uh, four phases, you're up, side, side, then back up, stretch them out. So four phase movement, um, just don't pull the head on those. Right? Then we're gonna go reverse crunch. Okay, so the legs are down for the Rockies, now they're up and you're crunching the hips off the mat, trying to get those lower, especially those lower abs really fired up on that movement. Uh, then we're gonna turn around, guys, back extension. We're gonna do a two count back extension for that lower back. That's it, guys, quick workout. 40 seconds of work, 10 seconds of rest. We'll get 30 seconds at the end of the first circuit just to kind of regroup and blast through it again. Guys, I'm gonna hit the start button. It's gonna count down from 10, and we're getting started. We're gonna start the starfish, so find an open spot on your mat or towel here. Arms are out, legs are up, guys, and we're gonna come just across and back. Rest the head you can, or you can keep it up if you feel like it's a little more tense. But just watch that neck that doesn't get too tight. Three, two, one. Excellent. So now we're going to get in a low plank position. I like my feet off the mat. We're a nice position, guys. Forward. Try to stay nice and flat. Guys, this is a cross crunch toe reach, so a straight leg toe reach. So it's kind of like you're doing half a bicycle. So we're here, reach. Switch sides.
Guys, the next exercise are the Rockies. Four phases, up, side, side, up. Here we go. Don't pull the head up. Whew. Feeling that core. Oh, man. Woo! Okay, reverse crunch here. We're going to just crunch the hips off the mat. So watch my hips on this one. You can have your hands down here, guys. Hit your side. And I'm going to just crunch those hips up. We're coming down. So my legs pretty much stay in the same position. I'm just crunching, doing a slow squeeze and back. So we don't want... We don't want any jerkiness or any ballistic moves here. It should be a nice, controlled contraction. Target the erectors now, so on the posterior side, uh, the muscles that help support the lower spine. So we're here, we're gonna pull up, hold for what you find there. Uh, one, two, three. But don't come too high, you just want to exercise those muscles. This is one round through, so it really goes pretty quick, right? So now we've got, what, another 24 seconds to recover. So a 30 second break here between the circuits. I'm just going to kind of <laughs> roll over here, take a couple deep breaths, and get ready for those cross reach to starfish. Okay, guys, we're down to seven seconds. Whew, here we go. Finish strong here. Arms out, legs up. Here we go. Opposite extremities. Coming toward each other. Soft, remember the low plank. You start to burn a little bit. Six seconds left. Three, two, one. Rest. Wow. All right. Guys, bicycle. Toe reach. Here we go. Here's the bicycle. And reach.
tough. Love those things. Okay, now we have Rockies, which may appear easy. If you did the first round, you know they're not. Here we go. Up, side, side. Don't pull the head in here, especially this last squeeze. Let the core do the work. Straight up, side, side, squeeze, back. One, two, three, four, count. Okay, now lower. So it kind of means how that works. The Rockies, you really feel really high, this down low. Nice compliment. Here we go. So squeeze those hips up and down. Okay, roll over guys, just like that. We're at our last exercise. Back extensions, slow and controlled. Try to keep the head down slightly. Just come up, one, two, not very high. That was our core workout for today. And man, these intervals are great because they really level the playing field for any fitness level. If you're more fit, you get more work. If you're just starting out, maybe not quite as much work, but you're still challenging the core, making it stronger, more efficient. Guys, thanks for watching. I really hope you enjoyed the routine. Uh, we try to bring fresh stuff to the other time and changing the exercises, different intervals, things of that nature. So uh, stay healthy and safe out there. This is Elite Fitness. We're bringing wellness to you.